ultimately, um, I've said it since I was eight years old, I want to race at the cup level. And um, I've made no bones about that, you know, and I, I say that and I open the door to being laughed at again and I say, bring it on. I love the truck series. I always want to be part of the Camping World Truck Series, but I also want to, um, I want to push us. But I don't want to jump in there until I'm ready. And as ready as I think I'm going to be, I know once I get there, it's going to be a, a whole nother world that you have to start all over and learn again. But I'm prepared for that. So ultimately, within the next couple of years, I would like to be at least some part of all three of NASCAR's top series, Sprint Cup, Nationwide, NASCAR Camping World Trucks, and competitive, not just running around. I think the thing that I'm most proud of this year is our team. We have basically four full-time guys and Mike Harmon oversees the operation for me and Mike knows what it's like to be an underdog. I told everyone, don't expect us to set the world on fire. We're gonna go out there and race. We're going to do the best we can and as long as we're getting better each and every week, then that's all we can ask for. Eventually we will win. Maybe not this year, maybe next year, but eventually that is what we're working toward. That's one of my biggest goals is just to do the seemingly impossible. I'm a motivational speaker on the side um, that just kind of came out of being um, knocked down so many times and having to get back up and the things I've had to learn and I enjoy sharing that with others. So uh, my goals for this year are to be an inspiration to a lot of people. A lot of people who've been laughed at, a lot of people who've been told it's impossible. One thing I say about female drivers, by the time they get to this level, they're pretty used to being a, a minority out there. And so it's no different, but as long as you show respect, especially on the racetrack, it's amazing the amount of respect that you get in return. I had one of our very top competitors look at me and point to me in front of a group of other drivers and say, you're doing awesome. And I was like, oh, he's talking to me. <laughs> you know, so it's, uh, it's been a wonderful year. Jennifer Jo Cobb currently sitting 16th in points. She is excited to be here at Bristol. She starts 32nd tonight.